Yo, what's going on there guys? You know Beard here. Today I'm going to be covering the Bearded Raven right after this intro. Alright there guys, so today, like I said, I'll be covering Bearded Raven. They uh, reached out to me, asked me if I wanted to review their products, and I said I would absolutely love to. So they sent me out three oils, two balms, and one butter to try out. So the first scent that we got here is their, uh, what is this, the Paladin here. Now the Paladin for their scent is, I got my piece of paper here that I'm cheating on, don't mind me is Arabian Sandalwood, French Lavender, Cypress, Rosemary, and Bergamot. Sounds pretty intriguing. So the first thing that I noticed about this scent when I open it up is it is a very earthy smell. Very earthy. I get a little bit of the, the lavender in there. The, uh, the other scents they kind of they kind of mix in there. Uh, bad with describing scents here, so. But I would. It's earthy, and uh, I get. It kind of smells like, in a sense, eucalyptus. I don't know, but the Paladin wasn't really one of my favorites there, so I didn't get to wear this one a whole lot. But as far as um, scent or lasting in beard I would say it was probably about four hours yeah three or four hours so a de decent amount of time for for beard length so and then the uh, the next scent that I got here was the uh, peacemaker now I think this one was my uh, my absolute favorite one in here my favorite one here so open this one up here and that one's got kind of a uh, a sweet smell to it. And this one here for the scent, don't mind me, I'm cheating, my cheat sheet, is uh, Lake Cedar Cedar Atlas, Earth Red, Spike Nard, Water Lily, and Jasmine, and Vanilla Bean. Now I think this one was my absolute favorite. Um, again, scent profile in there was sweet. I got a little bit of the vanilla in there, and then the rest of them combined very nice. I probably wore this one the, the most, and again, probably lasted about four hours. So, a, a decent amount of time in there, you know, and the, uh, as well as the other one. They weren't overly strong, but they were noticeable. So, if you like a, a lighter to, to stronger scent profile, you might like a these here and then the last one I got here is the Nord I'm sure you're probably looking at the labels there don't worry I think these are just samplers yours hopefully won't show up like this <laughs> but the Nord upon opening there was a uh, a strong like spearmint peppermint scent out of there and what it's supposed to be is Nordic blue spruce cedarwood, balsam fir, and spearmint. So, of course, like I said, the spearmint's in there. But that's the first thing that I get out of there. And as some of you know, spearmint isn't really my favorite either. So, <clears throat> I didn't get to wear, wear that one as much either. But, again, three, four hours isn't, isn't that bad. So, and I liked them. They made my beard feel feel excellent uh, throughout the whole day so as far as the oil goes and if you're if you're worried about that it was excellent I'd recommend it for the oils and if you're curious and what the oil contains there it's got a uh, my cheat sheet don't mind me I'll show you guys it's got uh, fractionated coconut oil kiwi seed oil avocado oil almond seed oil castor oil, 
and essential and fragrance oils. So as far as consistency goes, I would say it's probably a, a lighter to, to medium oil. Oil thickness doesn't really matter to me that much. I know some of you guys either like a lighter lighter oil or thicker oil, but this stuff here I'd say is probably a, a, a light to medium. So not a problem for me. It is what it is. So as far as the, uh, the bombs go here now, I got sent the Peacemaker bomb and the Paladin bomb. Let me show you guys the consistency here. I got these little samplers, but I don't know if you can see the consistency there. It's a very, very light to medium consistency. And when it melts down, just easy, nothing there. <laughs> and it's got a little bit of a styling properties to it. I know some of you guys like a, a stronger hold or a, a lighter hold. For me personally, when I'm looking for a balm, which I don't really wear anymore too much, I just wore it for the review. I like my balm to be uh, a firmer hold because if I'm wearing a balm, that's kind of why I'm wearing it. But some of you guys like the, the lighter styling balm, so I would say if you're looking for that, um, try these guys out. In the sense, smell exactly like their oils. So there's no difference there. Nothing really stands out more than the other from balm and oil. And then the, uh, the butter here, I really like the butter. For the butter here, oh, this one melted down. It is hot here in Arizona, but I would say it was like a, uh, a whipped. This here is just melted way down now. But, whew, we're getting into the, the 90s, hundreds here. But I can't really show you what this looks like, but it was like a, uh, almost a, a creamy whipped butter. And uh, just like the, the bomb, it melted right down. And then uh, it felt great in the beard. Probably a good eight, ten hours in beard. So I love this stuff. Other than those two scents, I would definitely buy, for me, the, uh, the Peacemaker. But the other ones, again, if you're into the spearmint or earthy scents, those might be for you. So as far as uh, pricing goes, you can get a one ounce oil for $13, um, a two ounce bomb for $16, and a, I think it's a three ounce butter for $20. So pretty good pricing actually, considering some of the market, I would say it's average market pricing, but the thing that that they do right I think is they offer free shipping on all their orders so my thoughts on the bearded raven is keep doing what you're doing bud doing great uh, those two cents that I didn't like are just for me I didn't care for them but that one cent I absolutely loved it um, to everybody else out there go check them out and uh, if you like this video give me a thumbs up leave me a comment below uh, scents you'd like to try, things you'd like to see, and uh, like, subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching.